welcome to the vlog. We're at church. Okay, we'll be quiet. Something's tugging at my sleeve I do believe it's Christmas It's cold outside but I'm warm within Cause Christmas time is here A merry game they play Chasing each other to and fro Laughing all the way Oh, what a jolly time To have the whole family here For a few days of love has gone It actually was on a Christmas day You came my way that once upon a long ago The Bethlehem star must have shown the way that led you to me Now from downstairs I have to work on my six orders uh, my six apron orders and now that I have my big light on I'm trying to see if I can I seriously don't there's got to be a stain on this otherwise I would have used it I seriously don't probably on the back maybe a lot of them were on the back side I don't know there's a reason I didn't use this apron I seriously don't know but I ain't gonna worry about it I know these ones have stains on them yes this one does there and this one's like really bad. This one's on that side of it. 
Anyway, I'm not going to worry about it. I got new ones in, and I'm just going to use them. So, I have to make six aprons. And this is what I do because these aprons come in one size. They don't have, um, that's a common plus sticker on them. They don't come in like a size small or medium or large. Just hoping they're not stained up like the other ones. This one actually does have a stain on it, so I'm not going to use this one. It's on the back side and the front side. You can see it on the back and the front. So this is one reason why I don't like this company because I've had issues with them. You can see it? It's right there. It's yellow. Right there. It's not going to focus on it, but yeah, you guys can see. So there's probably something that's probably on one of these ones down here. The one where I said I can't see the stain. There's probably something like that and I probably haven't found it on there. But I like to make sure or and just really go over them so that, you know, I don't get any complaints. Because, you know, I pro I wouldn't I wouldn't want to receive something that, you know, this one has a little, yeah, this one's stained up too. You guys, this, what, what's the deal? You see it? It's right there. I can't have that, yes, but I can't have that music in it. And then there's some, it's there, and I just saw it. Right there. Probably can't. See. I can see it under this light. I can see it. It's like a yellow. It looks the same as this stain. So that's two out of these. Now I will try to wash them. Will they come out? I don't know. Uh, I usually just wash. Like the last time I had um, the ones that were stained up, I washed. And I just use Journey's um, baby laundry. She uses all baby just because she has broken out from different uh, baby laundries, baby laundry soaps, I should say. Uh, we bought different kinds and this is so frustrating. Especially with the amount of, I paid 70 something dollars for these aprons. Okay? And I can't send this. I can't. This is like. It's three. This is the problem I had last time, too. The reason. So, so far I've got one good one out of the ones. I need six to complete these orders. I'm so. Drives me insane. And you know, I just opened it up and I already see stains. You know, um, there's stains here and down here. This is not good business. I almost I think I see stain on this one too. Maybe that was the bag. It is so, so, so annoying. And I'm not just being like, you know. I guess I am being picky because these are my customers. You know what I mean? And that one's okay. You don't want to send bad products out. You love Alyssa. I know you do. Mm 
But anyway, back to the soap. Um, yeah, we've tried. We've tried different um, laundry soaps with Journey. And she gets itchy and breaks out in hives. So all clear, it's like free and clear or baby or something. It's baby. It's not free and clear, it's baby. I already see a stain on this one. It's not horrible. Hopefully it'll come out in the wash. But this one is right there. I'm still not going to send it. Being in this business, oh, sorry. Being in this, it's right there. Being in the business, you know, people will find the teeniest, tiniest thing to complain about. So, <clears throat> double, triple check your stuff. So, I've gotten two out of all these aprons so far. Oh my gosh. It, like, totally makes me want to just, like, cry. Because I'm like, this one's... You guys, this is like the other package that I got. The other one where I'm supposed to, I should have already had enough aprons to send, but they were all stained up. The whole reason I had to order this package to complete the orders that I have. And then it took forever. This one's okay. Then it took forever for them to show up. So I got three. I need three more. practice tonight seriously guys I'm losing hope I'm pulling them all up so there are 25 of them and so far I lost count as to how many I've stained up You know, I have complained and I will complain. Um, and honestly, I don't know what to do because I do need the six aprons out of this. If I had, if I have some of the, if I have six stained up aprons from the last one, and if I can use six aprons that aren't stained up out of this one, then I might just swap them out and then just return it you know what I mean because after all it is it seems okay after all they are you know they came from the same place and they are stained up and it's not my fault and you know or I'll just tell them I'm trying to pick one that's I think this one's already jacked up you'll see right in the pack right in the picture like right through the front of the thing This one's stained up. It, it, I, I'm gonna have to return them. I, that's all there is to it. I'm gonna have to put all those back in the package. Because this is how many? I'm just getting more and more angry. That's what I'm getting. Don't let it ruin your day. This one's already stained up. I can see it. Is it? Or does it just look that way? I guess it was just the... <sighs> yes, it's okay. I better be checking these straps, too. Mm. Okay, how many are we up to? 
question why why do they have a green sticker on them does that mean oh they were good they were checked but honey those were not good okay we've got one two three four five i need one more good one one more good one I will complain about these. I will. I mean. I don't know if I have. That one's okay. I don't know if I have six. There, I know there's three down there that are dirty. So that's three. I see at least one more over there. That's four. I gotta have a couple more somewhere. Because I would have had enough to complete it. So I know I at least have six bad ones here somewhere. But the problem is. Some of them. I might have threw away already. Anyway. Uh, yeah. So I'm going to work on these. Um, it is 3.38. My husband went to work. And he was going to go buy Dunkin Donuts. And. I just told them to get me a hot cocoa. Um, they have the white chocolate, hot chocolate, and it was so good last time. So good. So I just decided I'd go with that. Plus, I've already had a coffee Coke today, and I had um, tea at dinner, so I, you know, or at lunch, whatever you want to call it here. They call it dinner. And in the nighttime, in the evening, is when you eat your supper. <laughs> so dinner comes in the afternoon. It's always, it always confuses me. I'm not from the south. This one looks weird. This one right here. It might be dirty. It might. It almost looks a bit I don't think it'll show up almost looks I mean it doesn't but it does you know what I mean it kind of looks like if I put on glasses and look at it it kind of looks like it's like got sprayed with something and it's like got this like I don't know a misting, a misting of oil or something. Let me see if I can find a different one. <sighs> I feel like I'm playing Russian roulette. Oh, this one's stained up. Never mind. All over the straps. What I should be doing is taking pictures of these because I will be complaining. I thought I brought my phone down. I don't see it anywhere. I don't know where my phone is, but anyway, as you can see, here's some of the staining. And then there's some on the apron as well. I'm not going to show you guys because I'm just going to keep it as it is kind of folded still. Well, you can see some of it there. Well, it going to show up. Where is it? Right there. Yep, yeah, right there. Um. Oh. I know people are going to ask too where, where where these are ordered from. It's a company called Chef Skin. And I do not recommend them. <laughs> so if you have ever contacted me and I told you Chef Skin, I am so sorry. I really am. But if I didn't need so many of one color, I would have never ordered from them again. But I needed, as you can see, I needed six pink. And on Amazon, all I found is packs that would have one pink per pack of colors. And so I would end up spending 
what is it? A hundred and something dollars just to get one pink apron. You know what I mean? Oh, stains. I opened it up and there was stains. Um, yeah. Okay. I think there was. Twelve. There's twelve right here. I think these ones are okay. I'm not positive, but I know it cut me off because I ran out of time when I was talking earlier. I don't even know where it cut off, but um, I did message them and I let them know that there was. I told them thirteen, so maybe there's thirteen there. I don't know. I'd have to recount. But anyway. Um, you know, 13 out of 25, and it was $70, so that's not very good, and who's to say these ones don't have stains on them, I just have to make sure I double check this really quick before I go as far as stitching it all out, I'm just, I'm just upset at this point. Looks good. Yeah. And uh, you guys, I'm not being picky because sometimes I feel like, oh my, no. Like, I wouldn't want to receive that. No, don't send me, don't send me that. Don't send me no stained up apron. that moon we're here for practice go crazy oh yeah we'll watch it we'll watch the tree go cry cry did it change red because the light's red <laughs> yeah i don't know no it okay. why. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you too. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Oh! Holy smoke, fat man. That's, uh, that's Miss Holly's oldest daughter. Is that Maggie? I don't know. And what, what's going to happen? Only the city and we get in prison so the police will come. Yeah? What and time is it? And the police will come at our house if we want. Oh, are we going to open all of these Advent time days? Advent time days? 
Yeah, Advent but, calendar? Yeah, by all of them. Yeah, but where's your sister? Uh, she's in behind me. Is she gonna come? Mm -hmm. Let me wait. You look up at my play doh Okay, I'll look and out was, for your play doh Elephant time, calendar time. Yeah, and the tree. Stop. Okay, here. You have her. She's scary. Okay, right here. This is I it. Want your husband, sissy. I don't want your husband's daughter. Who's her husband? Sebastian Bach. That's her husband. The pianist? You're done, you're done, you're done. Just get out. You're done, you're done, you're done, you're done, you're done, you're done. Wait, this is for you, snowman. Let me see, what is it? Let me look at it. Oh, it's an ornament. You can make little tiny ornaments. Don't use your teeth. Here, hop off. Hop off. You don't want it to break. All right, sisters. Okay, but you gotta get our poop Our poo. Don't talk about I don't that. I don't get anything. <laughs> Why not? I can't get That's day 23. <gasps> you get to open. You're done. You're done. You get to open this one. You get oh. to open that one. I don't get anything. I'll just take day 23. <gasps> then on day 23, you won't have anything. I have the day 12. There's like nothing right here. Let me see. Oh. Well, where's the other one? <laughs> Here, I will open mine. These two. I got Why this. All the way? I'm on day number eight. Okay, I don't know where did they go. <coughs> Which one do I get then? This one? You better put the other ones back. So it won't be a one? surprise now. <gasps> oh my gosh! Wait, Guess what I got? <laughs> Guess what I got, my teeth. Oh no, that one's fine. Mm, mommy! Aww. She said that was because I wanted it. Eyeliner? Yeah, I got an eyeliner. Mommy. Hey! <laughs> we can't fight. There'll be no sad faces on Christmas. Okay, here we go. Oh. <laughs> Will you get her puppets? <gasps> Guys, quit being so mean to each other. Uh, oh, she's yeah. just hurting me. Okay, I... we have to be good. Look, I'm vlogging. She's hurting me all the time. Oh, Sister, don't hit her all the time. <laughs> here. <laughs> What is it? Bunny. A bunny. Hip hip. <laughs> Can you say happy birthday, Stephanie? Where? It's my niece Stephanie's heavenly birthday. She's in heaven. Go get the birthday. Well, yeah. read it to me. Yeah. <laughs> Sterling. Mom, she always gets it. <laughs> so up 
to the housetop, the courses they flew with the sleigh full of toys in St. Nicholas too. Hi guys. So I'm down to my very last one. I have to embroider out pressure. Um, so I just took this one off the hoop. Now I got to hoop one more. I did message um, the seller of the aprons and let them know about the um, stains. We'll see what they tell me to do. Um, we will see. We will see. Cut. I can't. There's nothing I can do with stained up ones. <clears throat> I had the other ones I did wash, and there was probably, I don't remember how many total. And some of the stains came out of some of them, but some of them did not, so, you know. I just want to make sure I'm not sending anybody any stained up items. But we uh, went to practice, say practice. Um, journey it's um, I'm sure there's no stains uh, journey's an angel and so I mean she'll for the most part when she's focused she will do like the motions of the parts but like she might go through it one time and she'll do okay the second time forget about it she's just running all over and no matter what you do to try to get her to focus you know she just doesn't she's just I don't know then you're just like well don't you know I don't know why that cat insists on smelling I have aprons over there on a bookshelf and she insists because like the little um things are hanging down and she's always like sniffing on them I don't know why I don't know if she smell like something but anyway I'm going to do my last apron they're done all of my orders are done Which is good because I've got a card for my mailman, and yeah, um, so yeah, I'm done. I'm done. I don't know what I'm going to do with all of these stained up aprons. They're all right here. I'm just going right here for right now because I don't feel like fooling with them. This is the one I thought looked like it was, I don't know. It just has like a funny, almost like oil splatter marks. Probably ain't gonna show up on camera, but it just looks weird. Like it doesn't, when you just look at it, maybe it will show up here. Maybe. Can you guys see it? It almost looks like grease, kind of like grease. I don't know how else to explain it. I mean, if you just look dead on, I don't know. The I don't know. It's just weird. Anyway. Anyway. So now that I'm done with work, it is December 12th. It is my niece, Stephanie. It's her heavenly birthday. She's in heaven. Um, she passed away when she was four. So, uh, but anyway, these shipping labels, I went ahead and I did them all for priority mail. You guys, that just cost me like 50 bucks. Because there was 
five of them. Um, and then I'm going to see if I can cancel these ones because at least I'll get these ones are probably three dollars and something. But um, um, uh, Julie, cousin Julie, my husband's cousin, who is like my best friend here in South Carolina. I have like my best friend in Michigan. Like we are best friends. Tressa, Aunt T. You guys know her? Well then Julie, the person I do children's church with and it's my husband's cousin and you know, anyway. Um, she works for the post office and um, my husband was complaining about a package he's waiting for and it's been in Chicago forever. Like for at least over a week now for sure um, and it hasn't moved. And she was like, yeah, they're just really pushing, you know, like the priority mails and, you know, all that before first class mail or anything like that. Um, his is actually came from overseas. So his is like a international mail thing. Majigger. Mabobber. Anyway, so I'm kind of glad that I am shipping these out priority mail. So... Hopefully they will get them by the end of the week and all of my packages will stay delivered and everybody likes their stuff and I just want everyone to be happy. And I can be stress free now and I, I'm, I have to make a shirt for a little girl in the Christmas program. Um, she's a star so she has a star costume but the thing though it's like really awkward it's like an awkward costume so if she was to wear it like it's supposed to be worn like her like it's a star shaped like a star it has two points that come out here it's almost like a foam and then her arms are supposed to be down and then if she puts her arms down in the armholes like the top because her head comes out of a low point of the star like either it's going to be up here or if she pulls it down it's just it's just an awkward thing so we were trying to come up with an idea um for you know a different star costume so we were thinking you know of different things and i was like well what if we just like what if she was you know on a black shirt i embroidered like a big star just a star shape you know like on a shirt a big star right and they're like yeah that could work because I have that gold now that I think about it that gold might not be wide enough for a big star we'll see I'll have to dig it out I'll have to remember where it's at first <laughs> might be down here and not in that drawer um, it's somewhere if I can't find it, I know I can pick some up, like at, um, Walmart or, um, uh, Hobby Lobby or something. Or, you know what? I could even use glitter canvas. It's sparkly. But I was thinking more of, like, the, the dance material. It's really shiny. Like, it's, what is it? Lycra? 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 I don't even know how you pronounce it, but, um... So anyway, like putting the big star on a black, it's just going to be a big gold star on a black shirt. And then I thought, I was like, cause she wants to be like, you know, all that. So I was like, what if, okay, I get some, um, of the twinkle lights, you know, and what if, cause I'm like, how can I do that? Then I thought, well, if I just cut a little hole right and feed the lights through the hole right so the banner battery pack is going to be on the inside and I thought if I can make a little pocket that sits on the back of the embroidery um she's going to probably wear a leotard underneath it like a black one so if I put a little pocket that holds the on the inside of the star that holds the battery pack it's tiny um it's supposed to be tiny anyway I ordered them off Amazon I'm going to feed the lights out and then I'm going to take a needle and thread and I am just going to sew 
the lights to outline the star you know what i'm saying i even thought you know what i could my depending on how long of the pieces of the lights are like i can even kind of like just go back and forth i don't know how that would look to do the entire star you know so the entire star is glowing either the entire star is going to glow or i'm going to outline and just do wrap the lights around as far as they will go around the star and i'm just going to take like thread and just kind of loop it around the lights in different areas you know what i mean around the embroidery so that way it lights up the star and that's what i'm going to do for her and then her mom's going to figure out something for her head and you know and she's got a little gold skirt she's going to wear you know so she's going to be all like you know what that means <laughs> so um i'll probably do that i'll probably work on that tuesday the lights should be on a, in on tuesday so i'll probably do that um hopefully they arrive tuesday if they don't arrive tuesday we do have practice on wednesday so if they arrive before practice wednesday i'll try to do it get it done then you know Wednesday before practice uh, so I have that project to work on I still need to clean up down here and do stuff you know because I haven't touched down here I haven't haven't really wanted to because you know I'm just taking a break um, but you know I got my aprons done today and that was just great um, it was it's a different okay so when you have so many orders and you're just like chopping away at them and you feel like you're not getting anywhere it's it's like a different feeling than today where I like I knew I had six and that's all I had to do and at the end of the six I'm done you know what I mean it's like um, oh and I also I had a comment and somebody was like what do you mean um, never like normal like I, I'm, I probably commented like I just want to have like my normal orders like I'm talking outside of Christmas so when I was referring to it there is Christmas because Christmas is always super busy but just to kind of put things in perspective um, I think I last October so this is just month of October from the 1st through the 30th I had now this is last year like 123 orders I think it was last year okay so when I had the 123 orders for the month of October you know I was like you know that was a lot of orders for me okay and I thought okay you know it's getting busy it's getting it's getting it's getting kind of busy Hold on. get out to my calculator so if I had 123 and you divide that by 31 days Oh, actually, back it up. 30. Shoot. Okay. So, it's that averages out to about four orders a day. 3.9677194. <laughs> so, I was, you know, I was getting about four orders a day. This was in 2020. So I thought that was pretty good. And this year, I was averaging about 17.9354839. So about 18 orders per day from four to 18. So if that puts anything in perspective to why I was so like, all I do is work on orders and I need a break and yeah that's why because you know I went from now it wasn't like that like just like boom but October was just September was pretty busy September was when it really started to take off for Christmas and it usually is right after Labor Day is when it kind of usually just psh, um, it's almost like, you know, someone turns the handle and it starts, you know, starts to trickle. And then all of a sudden, it's like gushing out. Yeah, that's my orders for perspective. Like, it's, you know, starts off. Um, so that is why. 
I was going so crazy and now I'm not <laughs> anyway um, I am going to probably stay closed for um, until Christmas um, I might open up like I don't know I might open up I don't really know at this point I don't know I know I will have to open up because hello I got bills to pay and if I don't have any money coming in um, who's gonna pay the bills right so I don't really know but I know I'm going to enjoy this time I've been enjoying this time now that I have all my orders out the door and it's like whew. um I was gonna make journey a shirt like right now because I haven't made her any Christmas shirts and the she got three Christmassy outfits from Children's Place. Is it? No, car. Yeah, Children's Place. And that's basically her wardrobe that she has been wearing <laughs> all of December and probably since she even started wearing them whenever we first started get we first got them is when she started to wear those outfits. So I was thinking, well, I need to make her a Christmas shirt and we can put that in the mix. But you know what? I don't know if I am. I just turn my heat press off. I might just sit here and watch a couple of uh, vlogmases. I need to watch Jacqueline's and um, I got a bit of a headache. I might just call it a day. And we might go see some Christmas lights tomorrow. It depends on the weather. It depends, you know. But there's this place and we saw it yesterday coming home when we were Christmas shopping. And I was like, oh my gosh, what is that? My husband's like, oh man, it's lit up again. He said, last year we went through here and he's like, I think you fell asleep and I was hoping you didn't see it. Because uh, he knows I'm crazy about Christmas lights. And I was like, we have to go here. I need to find out what it is. So I found out what it was. And on weekdays, that is $30 a car. So you can load up your car and go for 30 bucks. On the weekends, it's 60. So... Um, I think we might do that maybe tomorrow I don't know but I'm going to end the vlog right here thanks so much for watching guys I will see you all tomorrow bye guys Christmas lights are all around thanks for watching see you tomorrow